I'm Robin Higgins and this is Chemistry and Solar Panels. Alright, so we've all seen solar panels, uh, usually in pretty hot, flat areas, and so let's break down how they actually work. Well, first we start with the sun and it shining onto the solar panel. So we have our little arrows of light and heat going into the solar panel. And so if we actually look inside a solar panel, it's usually mostly silicon. And so silicon is picked for solar panels because it has a very specific way of all of its electrons uh, forming a grid. So not one electron, like one electron doesn't belong to one silicon. They kind of are all shared. And so what happens is once you get, let's just have a little electron hanging out here. And let's say that sun goes right onto it and it gets heat, right? It gets energy. That's what the sun is. And it's the, let's say this electron gets so much heat that it's able to raise to an excited state. Basically, it just has more energy and then it starts moving around. And so they do this, uh, they pick silicon because it has a very stable grid, but normally silicon by itself isn't a very good conductor. So what they do is this thing called doping where they have little tiny impurities of another element that can kind of create holes for the free electron to go to. So usually the impurities, uh, one popular one is phosphorus. So let's say this electron uh, gets really excited and it's able to move to one of those holes that phosphorus has created. And this isn't happening just once, it's happening thousands and millions of times. And you see you have a bunch of electrons moving around. And this is actually what electricity is made of because all electricity is, is, is just moving electrons. So if you have a stream of electrons, you have a current. And so once you have this current, they have adapters to harness this current and basically collect energy. Um, and so this is a very quick and dirty way of explaining uh, how solar panels work. Basically, the sun comes in, heats up the electrons, electrons move, creating a current, and you've harnessed energy. I'm Robin Higgins, and this is The Chemistry of Solar Panels.